So you're a new streamer and you want to repurpose your content to be able to fit multiple platforms. But going back to check the VODs, especially if you stream for two, three, four, five, six hours or more is quite a hassle. Here is a tip that you can use to easily be able to tackle repurposing content for multiple platforms. So let me introduce you to the quick actions in your stream manager. Okay, here is what you're gonna see. It's gonna be different for everybody depending on what you have set up. But what I recommend you doing is clicking the plus sign, right? And finding add stream marker, okay? Now the add stream marker, what it's gonna do is while you're live, while you're chatting, while you're viewing or reviewing or whatever the case may be, something happens, you click boom on the stream marker and it's going to put a little uh, little tab in your stream. So when you go back to watch the VOD, you can go straight to it. But you might not know what each tab means. So me personally, I like to do the stream marker with description. So I've added it on mine, but we're going to add it here on this template. And now it's here. So now while you're streaming, you can literally be talking about cats or dogs. And you're like, oh, that's going to be a, a good clip for later. Then you like, boom, you hit that button. Boom, you hit that. And you describe it. Oh, it was talking about cats. Boom and you add it to the section. See, it shows boom. Then when you go into your video highlights, let me go to one for an example, just to see if I could uh, give y'all a live example here. And we'll click the highlight function right here. Once you click that, right, when you go down into your, what do you do that? You go into the timeline, you see this four right here? Look, oh, Preem got serenaded. This is the section I was talking about Preem in the video. So instead of watching, how long was this, this VOD? four hours, five hours and 49 minutes, instead of watching through six hours of content, trying to find the moments that I want to make content out of, all I have to do is just look at the markers and it's described, oh, this is Preem getting serenaded. Okay, this is Preem being smitten. And I'm like, boom. So I can just go straight to that and clip it. And I can share those to social media. You can even go as far as clipping them and using either the Twitch editor to go ahead and make a vertical video out of it or downloading it onto your computer so that way you can edit it on whatever platform you feel comfortable editing it. But that's just a quick way to get through the videos. That way you can output content like back to back. It makes it real simple. You just have that up and ready. And as you're doing, you can also add that into your OBS, this whole doc. You can put it as a doc into OBS so that way you can use it regularly without having to pop this out every time. But it's just a good thing to know where it's at. But yeah, you just boom. Anything that happens, bam, add the stream marker, describe it. Then later when you go through your VODs, you just go straight to the stream markers, clip what you need, boom, you're good to go. It's a game changer. I've been up since like 3 a.m. I don't hear the hate, what y'all say ain't in. All I know is go, all I know is grind. I'm on your head, so all I know is climb. Just know I'm different. If I see the targets, just know I'm gonna hit it. I don't know the fake, just know I live it. Anything I say, just know I'm in it. I know the ops and they lightweight. I'm in the zone and I might stay. Yeah, I'm on in the right way. Check the scoreboard, look why I play. They say sky the limit, that's too low for us. We showing up in the nosebleeds of the galaxy. When you think it's great, look, it's actually me. Yeah, it's actually me.